when you think about starting with domestic resource mobilization, one of the first questions you ask yourself is, why would I start doing this? And a very major uh, reason to do this is that you, uh, you, that you are seeking to diversify your sources of income. And maybe you have already learned in your daily uh, realities that uh, getting your money, uh, getting all your income from one source or just a few sources uh, sets you in quite a big risk. Because if one of those sources uh, goes down uh, in a major way, then your entire income uh, goes down and the projects that you that you want to you know develop and that you want to implement you know will uh, will possibly not take place so therefore there is an important reason for you to try and diversify your income uh, and spread them over a number of different sources in the uh, in the previous uh, screen, you looked at your own income pattern, or as we would call it in resource mobilization, your funding mix. And it's interesting and important to know what your funding mix looks like. Um, you have seen that there are several sources of income and also different levels. So you have the international level where you know, sources can come from abroad. You have a national level and the domestic or regional level. And in each of those levels, money can come from different sources. So looking at the domestic level, it can come from individual, individual donations. Um, so um, uh, individual donors who, get, who support you with, uh, with one-off donations or ongoing donations. It can be local companies and it can be volunteers who give them, who give you their time. On a national level, you can um, receive income through the government, through corporations, again through individuals, and of course there may be foundations and NGOs who support your work. And at the international level, again, it may be governments, but then from abroad, from other countries, it may be foundations again, international foundations and NGOs, and it can e even be supranational uh, uh, sources like from the World Bank, for instance, or from the EU. So finding the right funding mix is a really key a uh, uh, goal that you that you have and you know it is not so for every organization the right balance can be slightly different but what we what you could generally say is that you try and minimize your risk risks and you do that by avoiding uh, uh, to be over dependent on one income source so when you have like 70% coming from one source of income, then you know you are in uh, a bigger dis risk uh, than when you have spread your income over various different sources. So balancing, balancing those sources is an important strategy to, to, to uh, mitigate your risks for the future and to secure you know, a, a solid and healthy foundation for your funding income in the future.